Okay, good morning Kathmandu. Today, journey to Everest Base Camp begins and uh, for me, I'm just playing a passenger and I'm gonna fly with Heli Everest and our captain, Mr. Pablo here. Say hello. Hello, Bima, my friend. All good? All right, all good, nice. man. All right, let's have a quick chat. Uh, how long have you been flying? Uh, here in Nepal for three years and uh, around the world for seven to eight years. All right, we're almost the same. Uh, I started in 15 wow. myself. Also in the US, right? Yes, yes, yes. Me too. All right, cool, That's cool, nice. cool. So, uh, what are we doing? We're going to go drive direct track or we're going to go. What's the no plan? direct track today. Okay. We go follow the river by ourselves. Let's okay. see if we have some passes that will be open. If not, all the way to Lupa, low altitude by ourselves, following the river, and let's hope Lupa is open. Okay, so approximately 50 minutes? 50 minutes, approximately. Okay, cool. All right. How about then. you? What are you planning to do up there? Ah, I have good plans this time. I'm not flying, so I'm planning to stay a couple of nights in base All camp. Right. So okay, cool. Let's yeah. see. Let's I see was wondering, I like, why is your passenger today? <laughs> He's planning something. He's up to something. That's yeah. nice. So yeah, that's the plan. So let's see how it goes. All right. All right uh, yeah. Thanks. We'll talk more in the helicopter. All right. All right. See you there, man. All right. Uh, journey is gonna begin shortly. So loading up the last. Uh, Bags in. Okay, our captain just started up the rotors and I can see the rotors spinning. Okay, all set, rotors 100% RPM, we lift it up and we're turning. It's taking its sweet time for takeoff into the wind and uh, here we accelerate. And I'm sorry, but I have a good voice for a good commentary, but I'll try to give you the content right. Okay, now we are approaching uh, Lukla. Uh, we've flown already for 54 minutes and uh, we'll be landing in next uh, two minutes. You can see the Lukla and airstrip right in front of us. Final approach. That's our new helipad in Lukla. be changing helicopter and this one will be there next to the base camp and on ground Lukla okay here we are on ground uh, Lukla and uh, here changed Hello. captain Mr. <laughs> Philip hey guys <laughs> from not from Norway no from Germany <laughs> <laughs> I was just working in Norway <laughs> Okay, so now the plan is. Uh, okay, you're the captain. You're gonna tell me the plan. <laughs> well, the plan is now first going Namche, and then we're gonna go Dingboche, uh, Dingboche, 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 and then uh, we drop some cargo, and then uh, we fly the first two, guys two up shuttles and two shuttles to Everest Base Camp. And then I come and pick you up again. All right. And okay. We go all together up. <laughs> all right. A nice. quick, quick background. Okay. How long have you been flying? Because I need I to know. I'm a little skeptic, now. you know. <laughs> <laughs> it's my first day, actually. Ah, okay. <laughs> no, uh, I'm flying since uh, six years now. And uh, I started here in February in Nepal. Before that, I've been uh, five years in Norway. So, uh, All right. 
How's the mountain? I don't think uh, we're going to see any mountains today. Yeah, at least not till we pass Namche, Tengboche maybe. Then, oh, okay. uh, then it's getting right. a bit better. So after Ferry Che, it's for sure a bit better. So. All right, cool. cool. Yeah. Ready to go? Ready to go. All right, let's do it. Okay, again, Rotors is starting for a flight to initially Namche and then uh, Dingboche and then to base camp with our special friend, Mr. Philip as the captain and uh, uh, two more passengers on the back Miss Diapun and uh, a friend from Malaysia Okay, we're ready for lift up That's Arundai on the ground in the helicopter Everyone's busy taking pictures and videos Okay, now we're departing Namche for Dingboche And this is the famous Namche, how it looks From the helicopter And uh, the mountains are all covered up so far Hopefully we get a view of the mountains once we go past the uh, so we two are going to base camp. Uh, Philip just just dropped us off. Now uh, he's gonna take one sortie of bags to base camp, and uh, he's gonna come pick us up back again. And this place is Dingboche. And if you knew, if you continue straight up the river from here, uh, you'll arrive. Uh, you'll arrive uh, Island Peak and other peaks. And now I'm gonna introduce you to a popular Nepali actress here with me. Who is going to climb Everest this time? A little introduction, please. Namaste, Masiti Apun. So, uh, what's your plan? Let's share something. So, I'll just take base camp and there's a couple of days for this free rotation and then wait for a summit push. Have you climbed any other mountains before? Uh, so, we first say I've climbed Akongwa. Uh, Alright, I wish you all the best and uh, get to know more uh, about you in the base camp. Alright, okay, sure. Meanwhile, <laughs> we just enjoy the weather. Yeah. And the helicopter is going to come back. Thank you. Okay, here comes Philip to pick us up. Did one sorry to the base camp, and next uh, it's going to be one uh, light stuff and two of us trying to get to base camp. All right, just lifted up from Dingboche, going up to Everest Base Camp. We have ferry chair down there. Captain Philip again, giving us the right. Right down there is uh, Tugla, uh, we call also called Tugla, and uh, that's the part of the hiking uh, stop. And you can see the hiking trail, and coming right in front, right over there we have uh, Serpa Memorial, burial of the Serpa, and that's Lobuche, right down there. Lobuche Peak covered up. And we have pyramid right over there. It's also the resort center for mountain weather. And this is the glacier. We can see the 
live example of a global meltdown. You can see uh, used to be at this level, already it has gone down to so all the ice that was in the glacier has melted, causing the landslide to form and then uh, all the rocks to settle over the glacier. In front of us we have to the left hand side of the glacier is a uh, respace camp. I hope to make it my home for the next uh, couple of days. But since I'm coming direct from 4,600 feet to 17,000 feet, let's see how my body takes it. And that's the glacier and the base camp. And uh, I was talking to Philip even before he came to Nepal. So we were friends on Instagram and finally getting to fly with my buddy. That's our helipad. You can see the Nimsdai camp and a couple of people down there waiting. My buddy brother being my David. All right, thank you, my friend. All right, Philip departing uh, base camp is gonna give a quick tour of base camp to his clients going back down. And unfortunately, I left my bag in Dingboche, so I'll need to survive with what I have. Kids, brother? Thanks, sir. Here on ground, Everest Base Camp, uh, ultra uh, luxury setup of names like camp in here. Okay, welcome to Base Camp, and I have with me here our famous legendary mountaineer by Mr. Mingma David Sherpa. Welcome to Captain Sa. <laughs> So actually, he liked to only fly. <laughs> Everest Base Camp. Now, let's see. He is staying with me now. I'm so climbing Everest. <laughs> <laughs> so my Bai Mingma uh, had invited me over so many times to come and stay, spend a couple of days with him in Base Camp. So here I am, here to see what my Bai does in the mountain in his playground. Because uh, I've seen him my always. playground a couple of times, so now he's gonna show me his playground a couple of, uh, a couple of days. I think billion people, billion people, only dream to come every space camp. Mm -hmm. But my dream start from here. Okay. Now. Yep. <laughs> now. And uh, as we are, we want to go out tomorrow. Matthew, I don't got to get acclimatized. And. Uh, so uh, since I'm here with uh, Mingma, and I'll also give you try to give you a VIP tour of uh, Elite Expedition Camp. So what's the setup? What people do? What people eat? And where they sleep? Everything? Okay. Well, we're ready for uh, Nepali lunch, and uh, I mean, I mean Nepali like kile hanuman porsare. I mean. <laughs> Only the good thing is you can see hot water at base camp, so you don't normally get it. So we hello, hello. Hey, hello. Hey. Mingma, we decided to go Nepali style. Atle lunch ma buff kiri, buff meat, soup, ani rice, piru and ani lacha. I'm just resting in the base camp. Just had my coffee. Everyone is busy with their phone or as we speak. Uh, we got uh, information that uh, Climber was a bit feeling unwell at 7,600 meters. So me and my David went outside and is talking on the radio to see if uh, they need to coordinate a rescue attempt or something. These two guys here, they are from Mexico and Peru. Hello. 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 
How are you guys? All right. Met Captain B, right? Yeah. You guys are gonna be on my blog, so if you wanna tell something, what brings you to Nepal? Hello, I'm Victor from Peru. Now I'm here in Everest Base Camp, enjoyed from this beautiful place with a, a lot of really good friends from different part of this wonderful country. And also we are with my friend here, Juan Pablo. Juan Pablo. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Juan Diego. And yeah, and we are drinking coffee in this Everest base camp from Elite Expert. And yeah, uh, say hello for everybody. Where are you going? You're going climbing Everest? No, this time I want to climb a Lotse. And yeah, we'll see what's happening up there. Hello everybody. My name is Juan Diego. I'm from Mexico. And um, I come here with a very interesting project. I'm trying to be the youngest Mexican to ever climb Everest in Lotse. A youngest Mexican to climb one 8000er and two 8000ers. I want to also play the piano or keyboard, the highest it has been played. I think it's going to be maybe in camp three, maybe four. We'll see how the weather goes. And the youngest to complete a double header of the higher 8000ers, um, Everest and Lotse. So yeah, just met a captain here. Uh, I wish he takes me up to some beautiful places and I get a glimpse of <laughs> a different glimpse but uh, yeah I'm very happy to be here I've never been to Nepal before very beautiful guys beautiful culture and uh, very happy so hello everybody and see you next time हमरो साथीहरु रेस टु गरेर तर ल्याउन गएको क्याम थ्री तिर कता कता पुग्छ खाली कारो भए पनि अपडेट पाउने यहाँ खबर पर्छ Okay, the weather has uh, blocked. That's uh, looking south from the base camp, and uh, now we are heading up to Itare base camp to coordinate the rescue mission that's going on. And I have another few friends over there, which. Uh, We'll meet. We have Ming Wei David and Amro Bai Ajay. Okay, Ming Wei David went ahead to coordinate the rescue mission because the is trying to arrange the oxygen for the climber who was feeling sick. I'm in the light kitchen now and getting myself a. Hot ginger water drink. I'm a 8,000 meter chef. Chef Padai is cooking. Uh, what cooking, Padai? You see, as you quickly realize, dal bhat, tarkari, dinner planning, Padai rasu. Azar. You see, fast side, you see, cooker boiling, Padai rasu. Chicken. The chicken, I'm like, as a government, what are they going to do? You as a say, why not? You as still in that. Yeah, okay. That's not you. आज त हामीले नि टन्ने तरकारी फलफुल लाग्छु नि हैन हजुर फलफुलहरु आको रहेछ टन्ने अब नेवार आइछ सेल आको रहेछ मलाई धन्यवाद है धन्यवाद तपाईहरुलाई मै ड्रिंक इज ए ड्रिंक खोल्न त यो खाल खानालाई त यो खोल्नु पर्यो नि लुक्स लाइक इट काइन्ड अफ गट स्नोड इन यु क्यान सी वाइट फ्रिजिंग सुगर नाम हो नखाने सुगर अलिअलि Last risky news I updated uh, the climber uh, luckily started talking and uh, slowly started walking back down so hopefully no rescue will be required at least for him however I might need a little bit of rescue here since I <laughs> came directly all the way from Kathmandu It's been almost uh, three and a half hours since I landed. So far, so good. I just have a mild uh, feeling of uh, breathlessness uh, on myself, but other than that, I'm feeling perfectly fine. Uh, still here, sitting in the cafe. This is the school I went training, and here I have another pilot. Sabrina from Austria who also did her commercial helicopter license from the same place. 
and but she's here with a mission. So mind the sharing. My mission is forever Everest. Okay. So what's the plan this time? What did you accomplish and what's left uh, to be done? Um, I started from sea level in Diga. It's uh, in uh, India. So approximately 200 kilometers to the south of Kolkata. Uh, with two Nepali friends, Lakshmi Magar and Haka Lama. And we cycled through India all the way up to Pirat Nagar, Chakbeni, where we crossed the border to Nepal. And on our mountain bikes, we found the way up till Buxa, where I gave my mountain bike to them. They took it back to Kathmandu and I started to trek. Then I did trekking till Gorakshep, where I arrived on 23rd of March and started to acclimatize myself with a lot of hikes here around Everest Base Camp. Uh, a week later I settled down in the Everest Base Camp and I saw all the effort, what's necessary to build up such a huge base camp. And then all the other team members joined me for my first rotation up to Camp 1, Camp 2, Camp 3. And now I'm finished with the first rotation and just relax uh, here in base camp and waiting for the next rotation. And I heard uh, you're planning to do this expedition without uh, supplemental oxygen? Yes, that's my mission from sea level till Everest summit without oxygen. And uh, when she's free in her free time, she is also uh, doing a municipality service uh, from uh, seeing herself responsible, feeling sad about the trash lying around. <laughs> Come on, let's say something about the trash. Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I'm climate ambassador for the International Judo Federation and also the chair of the Athletes Commission for our judo team. And I have two judo schools in Kumchung and Manchu. And we always teach the children there collecting the waste, uh, saving the planet with a lot of like educational training, how to separate the waste. And when I was like here in Gorakshep and always went to, between Gorakshep and Everest Space Camp, I saw a lot of rubbish and I started to collect it and so each second day I had like 10 kg so this was a lot and I think it's also very important to to keep in mind here all the people and all the, the clients who climb Everest to show them uh, if we start in a small uh, project to collect the waste it helps a lot. Thank you so much. Thank you. So tell me Hello. what brings you to Oh, I'm here for the first time. I decided to become uh, expedition doctor and I uh, received such a chance for uh, elite expert. So I'm very happy because it was my dream always. <laughs> In my everyday life, I do something totally different, but this is kind of my professional hobby, like mountains and mountain uh, medicine. <laughs> right, so if I fall sick, then you're going to be taking care of me. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> Where are you from? I'm from Poland. So, so quite far away. Uh, is the plan are you going to climb any mountains this time or you climb any? Uh, I already climbed Lobuche East Peak here, so it was a wonderful experience for me. And I would like to continue in the future, like, you know, learn more how to uh, behave in mountains, how to walk, how to feel safe there. So maybe uh, I will do it after I come back. <laughs> okay, thank you. Good luck. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, see you. <laughs> We're sitting here by the fireplace, talking, sharing experiences about very th various things, various nationalities from various places, Australia, Mexico, Peru, Nepal, Poland, Austria, and uh, it's been uh, seven hours since I landed and uh, I vote for a movie as well and I'm gonna do a little bit of uh, deep breathing uh, meditation to help myself with the oxygen and this table, cauliflower, tikibar, masu, meat, okay, and 
green uh, sag, pepper, rice, dal. What are these? Oh, baby. The dinner table set, and uh, well, literally everyone there is from a different country. May 6, good morning from Everest Base Camp. And this is exclusively Moomstai Ali Light Expert tents, as you can see. And uh, before uh, sharing the plan for today, last night was a very long one. I didn't fall asleep even for half an hour so that was a long long night because I came all the way straight from Kathmandu so which is not recommended now once the other crew members are done finishing the breakfast okay we're right here outside self member kitchen can you go my David Munjaring <laughs> Okay, now we're walking towards the technically this practice. So, he's is going to teach us how to turn up and down the ice. Ami, what's the plan? What's the plan? Ice climbing training. What do you mean to go to the new? Oh, basically I'll go up. Help. Then this is a traverse climbing. How to ascend, and how to crossing ladder, how to abseiling, and how to descending, which is, okay. and then some crampon techniques. Uh -huh. Also okay. later. So this is the first time I'm gonna try attempt do this. So we have an agreement. Mingma teaches me mountain, and I teach him helicopter. Okay. Right. Yes, <laughs> yes. I'm flying. <laughs> Next month. Yeah. It's possible. Okay, just a while back I had asked uh, where do we get our uh, drinking water for the camp from so you can see here they're filling it up okay looks like this is gonna be our playground for the next few hours The first time I can I'm seeing a glacier river. Before this, I had only seen in Alaska. But we have a few here. Mingma is prepping. The team member is up there. Hi. Lava. My last match. I'm going and he's sick, and he's making my last one. I believe we should have covered the blood. I was any lapid. Hello, Namaste, everyone. We will take a blog here. Boss, no, 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 Thank you, Mirbai. Okay, you can see the glacier. Pretty solid. The river. The team, the turning team. More ropes. The other side. Again, I'm 
personally experiencing them this for the first time in my life I flew over here so many times but never touched the ground here Okay. 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 My wife is teaching me how to put in the crampon. You put it on the right, so I'm gonna try to do it myself on the left. So, way is this guy goes right here, and then this guy goes right here, and then this way. Okay, now, right now, we're heading to another part of the training to cross the ladder if I heard it right I have the crampons on my legs oh. like this you can see you need to put the front and the back always front and the back this is more like stable yeah. but in more time Okay. It depends how do you feel better, how do you feel comfortable to do with these guys, okay? Pay attention, always, step by step. If you don't know, you can do it this. You can do that? No, you can't. Why? Because this, you, you go, yes, unstable, you want to lose the, the balance. It's for that reason, if you want to do it this, it's better to do it just uh, pass to pass, not like this. Okay. Right. Oh. He's climbing using a tumor and all of us are waiting here. We said we are. I'm pretty sure no one is as excited as I am. We're all, I think we're all the same. <laughs> no, we're all very similar, mate. We're going to get across this ladder. Uh -huh. We're going to tumor up and rappel down. This line is happening? Ah, with that. Don't take you. Okay, nice.
Oke. Oke. Finally done some uh, climbing. Uh, tried new stuff. Totally mind blowing. And in such a gorgeous place. Glacier water flowing right next to me. The base camp. Uh, having come here so many times, this is the first time I'm getting to experience first hand. So very delighted. Many many thanks to that expert Nims Dyson and Miller. My dear friend uh, Mingma for this opportunity. He even gave me his uh, boot that he's gonna use to climb the Everest at the camp points. So, yeah, overall a great experience. Make my David showing how it is done. Walked up to the popular base camp uh, photo point. You see right there. Everest base camp 5364 meter. A lot of people. Just notice something. Even this rock is sitting on ice. You can see. Hiking, I'm gonna have a down king good idea about how we're walking to us back to the base camp. I, mean, I did have a few questions for Mingma, so as we walk back, I'm gonna start because I was uh, I heard uh, the Everest base camp, this city which stays on the rocks, keeps moving, and uh, no other to ask than our legendary David. Hello, bye, brother. How does it work? Here the kids are. Yeah, <laughs> This is a place that is not 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 that rock fall down. Rock fall, I think, you know, sun's good, the rock lip protect the rasunda. This machito, you to rock fall, I see, you you melt on the rock lip cover this one month, you to ice the melt, I see, ice cream, ice cream. So basically, all of the Everest base camp is just like that uh, ice, right? So it's covered so many times and then because of movement the ice gets exposed and then it gets melt and it keeps moving, keeps the changing. It's a normal thing, but you can have any good cheese over your ice billion one. It's a normal thing, it's a billion. But uh June Pushes ma Pistar will natural it is what it comes down of building the thing. It's a big problem. Now you say it's melting fast. Yes. Ani, so this very winter my new person, he the ice or reform pani unja. Reform pani wire, reform wire. Personal unche naam lo gula wo. Tera melt wire. Is tarre is tarre gaurde jaan unche. Is normal. Tera zahe ko bata. Achhi to fast build the pillar jaan unche is problem. Thank you, Bengma. Come back to you with another question. Okay. 
then the next question as we were walking i did see a couple of uh, bags full of garbage so how does the garbage work here like do people leave them back or uh SBCC so I got to go to the company and we need to give garbage also we need to pay garbage for transportation that even lacks a mile a yeah but the only one on just a bit and he is good and the kilo ones are going to pay when you go in person and you are listening to something good out on process of another pollution come to visit as we see it's a basically one door policy you if you say I want to carry back my own garbage, can you? Or? No, we need to keep the uh, species. Okay, another question. Uh, how about the health facilities? How does it work? Do every health facilities? Okay, that's one of the health facilities. Yes. So, on that uh, altitude, not very high. When it's summer, when it's summer, and see the case with that, me. Really, just a rest area, just look like that. Me, I thought I can't manage that. Tip for the tip, then garni. तरती दिमाग रहेगा ना आपने आपने क्या मार बनी करती ली जनरल मेडिकल से फर्स्ट जनरल फर्स्ट कोर्स तो आपने समझ में नॉलेज चाहो ना आपने फर्स्ट आपने ली टेकिंग करने को लाया वो सेकंड बने कुछ आपने आपने क्या मार बने होना सकता डॉक्टर होना सकता नर्स होना सकता आपने आपने क्या मार पारामेडिकल होना सकता अन्य त्यो कत्यो नवाह को टीम को लागे चाहे एप्रेस में जो स्पेशली अच्छा रहे मारा रेस्क्यू एशन सिस्टम लेके वो एक क्लिनिक सेटअप कर दे हमसे यहाँ गए जो नम्र चेकअप कर दे को अन्य अलग अलग कॉन्सर्ट करने को मन पड़े होने चाहे कुछ जना मेंबर्स है एप्रेस होल पेस के में आपने टीम में वक्त मेंबर इस मेंबर से हंड्रेड डॉलर चाहे टेन ये रहने रजिस्टर होने पर सोते समय से वहाँ हर ले ची मेडिकल संग हेल्थ संग इन्हें पनी फर्दर कोई अरु बुझने मन पड़े होने चाहे जब फिर आपने गए रह बुझने सकें चाहे अच्छा रहे सो यू हैव टू लाइक प्री गो एंड बुक विद देम सेइंग ओके आई हैव फाइव मेंबर्स दिस टाइम सो आई एम गोइंग टू फाइव हंड्रेड डॉलर्स एंड देन दे विल टेक केयर बेसिकली पॉलिसी जो वहाँ आती हो तो बाय ना बने ची अन्य यहाँ पे पेय करने पर सम मेडिकल वगैरह इसको लाके बेसिक पेय करने पर सो डू वी हैव आवर ओन मेडिकल फैसिलिटीज हम इस जगह वो ऑफिशियली हम इस लाइक वो कामर कंपनी के लाइक सब जगह के लागी डॉक्टर आया लिस्ट जो डॉक्टर वो पोलिन मरा लाया सर अन्य वहाँ से हम लोग फुल एक्सपीडिशन सुरु देखी अंतिम समय बेस्ट कैंप में हैं जो नेक्स्ट टाइम लव जी क्लाइमिंग कर रहा फिर बैक वाला हम इसे बेस्ट कैंप में फ stay in the base camp and what's their base camp routine what they do normally do koi the logistics of what they have on climbers and in nepal is a juju course so let's say we have a fantastic job with it and it's a moment of the culture full time the horary hour on last on the top of the country what do you guys see 30 to 55 days आज एक क्लाइमिंग ये बस लोची को दिन जी क्लाइमिंग से सीख जा। अच्छा, व्हेन दे आर नॉट क्लाइमिंग, व्हाट डू दे हैव एनी रूटीन्स इन द बेस कैंप? व्हाट डू दे व्हाट डू दे डू? बस तो जैसे कश्मीर वाला आओ तो खेली नॉर्मली हाई एल्टीट्यूड में आओ तो खेली बिस्तार बिस्तार आओ ना बन ते का दिन में दो तीन घंटा दो तीन घंटा ते तो तो घंटा का जब ले बंद है तो आठ दिन चुप कोई साफ़ दे जी कल तो लोग ये बोल रहे हैं और आखिर जी कहाँ नॉन डूबर आए बस दस क्या बोलते हैं रफ़ली सब ने दे बाहर सा अन्य बाहर एक आया होने से आया आठ दिन चुप ना सकता ते बारे तो बिस्तारी � सेशन होने चाहिए आइस माल और मेरे कोशिश क्रॉस होनी है तीस पच्चीस बिस्तार बिस्तार ही आइस माल और फर्दर हाइक शुरू होने चाहिए अन्य यहाँ से क्लाइमिंग पुश चाहिए कौशली एक रोटेशन कौशली दूसरी रोटेशन कौशली तीन रोटेशन अन्य जो चीज़ उधर ऑक्सीजन एवरेज लोच क्लाइमिंग करने में आने चाहिए अं जो ऑक्सीजन यूज कर रहे हैं तो क्लाइमिंग करने आए बोला कि चीं यहाँ थ्री मीटर सेवेन थाउजेंड वन हंड्रेड मीटर यहाँ से मत टच कर रहे हैं तलाव में तीसरी रोटेशन हो जाए इस पर चीं बेस विंडो ये रहा समिट प्लान से हो जाए
इस पर चीज़ समिट करी सके पची ऑप्शन वाले का सेफ बार फर्क ही नहीं बंदा कह रहा है ना द एज इक्वल एज इट इज़ गोइंग अप इक्वली इम्पोर्टेंट इट इज़ गोइंग लाइक दैट सब ये बंदा थोड़ो समिट करे सक्सेस सी पति ले समिट के वजह से बंसा तर एज अ गाइड लीजिए बार फर्क के वजह से सक्सेस हुआ है बंदा ना बसे Made it back to the tent. Can barely walk. It was like stuff training in the ice fall. And uh, pretty cloudy all day today. Not even one helicopter made it to the base camp. Uh, so now change and relax is the plan. Good morning, people. This is my day three in the base camp. I'm sitting here at the cafe. And uh, the plan today is to go hiking up to Kalapotsar. And personally me, I'm feeling uh, a bit weaker. I'm uh, supposed to feel better, but uh, uh, looks like the altitude is still hitting me. However, Mingma says uh, after the hike, I should feel a lot better and uh, be like a normal person. Let's see how that goes, the hike. Kalapathar is uh, roughly three hours round, uh, round trip is what he says, but uh, I don't know. We'll see how it goes. So I just had my breakfast, waiting for the others. And now we should be out on our way. Hello again. I'm sitting right outside the tent where I slept last two nights. And this is what I can see from here. Okay. It's a good morning. So, the city sitting on the ice and rock. So, I don't feel I have the energy to hike today, so I might as well just cancel it and uh, head back down. The helicopter that's gonna come come up here later to pick up the uh, to drop the uh, like team members. So let's see at the moment energy. Missing some energy in here. Let's see how it goes. Yes, I stick to my decision. I don't feel the energy to go hiking up to Kalapathar. So, so bye bye. And David for his mom hospitality and this dog here is the dining hall. Anyways, thank you so much. I'll see you again. So sad. Mirabai, thank you so much for the warm hospitality. Hey, let's go. My sister's going to Diria. My sister's going to eat. My sister's going to eat. Diria, 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 and you can drag me up to the other hand pad despite my energy level. So the upper that's supposed to come pick me up hasn't yet left that under so I have another couple of hours in here. And uh second gear we're walking in between the camp which is not allowed. What's it supposed to be? So we'll be back with me some cookies. मुझे बदमाश और नहीं आमाश आगे सुबह माश में मंजर ना देंगे कौन सी तो सुबह दिखाओ नहीं बंद सुबह मन का मन का यू कैन सी द कैंप वी वर्क इन वाइट टू वाइट डोम्स इन अपर हाफ्स और नहीं बाय द वेस्ट वाला जी इज़ आल्सो माय बिज़नेस पार्टनर वी आर फ्रॉम आर ट्रैवल कंपनी and he plans to climb Everest this time. I wish him all the best. That's going to be good for our company too. Yeah. Hello. Okay. Let's go expedition. Go. Come on, Lakpa. 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 Me, my. You want to go expedition? I'm going to. Me, I'm going to go expedition. Very, very good. Very. Very good. How much is it? I got. I need to go. Definitely go. Wow. 
The plan is I'll uh, just hit a ride with uh, whichever helicopter comes and get my bag later into the club.